Hi and welcome back to the channel and thank you so much for clicking into this video. So in this video, I am going to teach you how to install Yarn in Visual Studio Code. Make sure that you stay until the very end of this video so you don't miss any important step for information. And without further ado, let's get on it. So the first thing that you need to do here if you want to install the Yarn in Visual Code is to first download and install the Yarn, initialize your Yarn or initialize Yarn in your project and then install the dependencies. So I'm going to show you on the next part of this video the detailed instructions. So to download first and install Yarn, just visit the Yarn website and download the installer for your operating system. So just follow the installation instructions provided and to verify the installation just open the command prompt or terminal and simply run yarn version so just open your project in vs code so with your installation open your project in vs code so if you haven't already created a project you can do so by selecting file and then clicking new file and saving it in a new folder so this command creates a package json file in your project directory which is essential for managing dependencies with yarn so next what you need to do is to initialize yarn in your project or to install the de dependency or initialize first so in the vs code terminal just navigate to your project directory and run so just simply click the yarn in it so again yarn in it so this is the directory you need to run this command right here and again this command creates a package um, json file in your project directory which is essential for managing dependencies with yarn and next what you need to do is to install the dependencies so to add dependencies to your project just use the yarn add command on your device and then for example yarn add express so by following these steps yarn will be installed and ready to use within your visual studio code environment and this setup allows you to manage project dependencies effectively and leverage yarn's capabilities directing or directly from your coding workspace so this command adds the express.js library to your project and updates the package json and yarn that lock files and so that's it for this video that's how you can install the yarn on your visual code so i hope this video helped you and if it did please make sure to like subscribe and hit notification bell button so you don't miss a video thank you so much for watching and have a great day Bye bye